Yeah, man. So, uh, I'm a penguin and I'm auditioning for American Ninja Warrior because I'm awesome and I want to go to Japan and be with my Japan penguin friends. So I Google image search Japanese people and this is what popped up. A little crazy, a little weird, but who am I to judge Japanese tradition and culture? You might be wondering, how does a penguin resemble a ninja? Other than the crazy awesome wardrobe, I would say. Black is nice, right? We sneak up on you, it's a sneak attack. Ninjas can't fly, penguins can't fly. Can't fly so good, so you guys fly me across the world. It's legit. Here's some strengths that I'm gonna bring to American Ninja Warrior. One, I can survive harsh climates, crazy obstacle climates, I'm going to prevail. Number two, I got a great wardrobe, smart, it's funny, and it's great. And my third strength, which is not my final strength, but the last one I'll list for you in this interview to keep it brief, is I'm a fantastic swimmer, which, I mean, it's not even like I'm going to need it, right, for this obstacle course? Not like those chumps that need the, uh, the safety fluid of American Ninja. Frog dude trained me for this American Ninja battle. Just training Penguin Chick a couple weeks ago. And you know, I pretty much taught her everything I knew. Didn't really train me, I'm gonna be honest. He didn't really do anything. I, I, taught, I taught her everything. All right, do uh, jumping jacks. Why don't you do more jumping jacks? Yeah. Yeah, you're training real hard. Cool. The way she was handling herself out there just Complete instinct. Now do uh, do do an athletic move. Yeah, this training's gonna run you about about twenty dollars an hour. So probably gonna be here all day. Some might wonder why he's even training me. Let me tell you what. It's political. He's got some contacts. I need some contacts. He knows some people. I now know those people. It's Los Angeles, baby. Hey, uh. When I was little, I uh, jumped from pretty high up without mom watching and uh, kind of fell and kind of hurt myself and like, you know, wasn't cool and like... I mean, how, how would you feel if, if you woke up one day and you couldn't fly, huh? I mean, I mean, who are you to judge, huh? Kind of figuring out I can't fly and having to deal with that and then here and I'll fly to Japan. Ah, how would you feel? This is a tragedy. Penguins can't fly. Why? Yeah. yeah, I'll be alright. Right? You said? No. Yeah, do some push-ups. You're doing, you're doing it all wrong. Your form's all. You gotta fix your form. Do it like. Yeah. Yeah. yeah see now you're exercising. You're feeling the burn. So penguins waddle a little bit. So they don't go really fast a little bit. Japanese penguins waddle fast. You ever see a Japanese penguin do about you? Aw, oh, come on, you can do better than that. Uh, you should uh, feel the burn. Yeah, you got it now. Yeah, it's a little amateurish, but you got it. I said it. Oh god. <laughs> that didn't last very long. No, the thing was, it, you can't really grip on that. No, yeah, it was obviously not you. <laughs>